Bucky Badger, it's all your fault if you hear the criticism come college football playoff selection time. Mark Rogers TV, the voice of college football, ranking all the schedules in the Power Five plus the major independents. That's 70 teams, and we understand that some of the major, major independents, in quotes, have worse schedules than the group of five. But this is how we're playing it, and uh, we've got Wisconsin up next. So they are the entry Uh, The first one from the Big Ten, they have the worst schedule in the Big Ten. They have one of the worst schedules in the country, as they did in 2017, and almost getting within seven points of making the college football playoff. All right. And this comes from a program that traditionally schedules somewhat difficult non-conference games. Not USC difficult, but uh, twice against LSU in the last three to four years and a game against Alabama to open the season. But uh, this particular schedule likens itself to last season. But there's a few major upgrades. We will get to those in just a second. But right out of the gate for Wisconsin, Western Kentucky, New Mexico, and BYU. Wisconsin last year went to BYU. That was their one big game in the Power Five. And, of course, the Cougars were awful at 3-9. and nine, And Wisconsin bludgeoned them. And that was in Provo. This time they get the return trip from most likely a better BYU team, but still a four-touchdown underdog, something like that. So Western Kentucky, New Mexico, and BYU all rank in terms of the preseason power index worse than 89th in the country. That's Wisconsin's non-conference. Of course, they play in the Big Ten Western Division, not a strong division, especially if you take them out since they don't play themselves. So it's a lot of Minnesota, Illinois, Purdue getting better. Iowa's decent. Nebraska might be okay, might be a 500 club. Northwestern's decent. They don't have to deal with any elite teams in their division. The difference this year to last year and why this is a more difficult schedule noticeably is Wisconsin dealt with Michigan in Madison last year. This year they've got to go to the big house to take on Go Blue. Also going to Penn State. So Wisconsin, other than the Michigan date, uh, they circumvented the rest of the Big Ten Eastern Division, Ohio State, Michigan State, and Penn State. Not so this time. They've got Michigan on the road. They've got Penn State on the road on November 10th. So it's decidedly a more difficult schedule, but still in comparison to the rest of the Power Five and specifically the Big Ten. Not so tough. Number 62 in the nation. Number 14, dead last in the Big Ten. The easiest schedule in the conference belongs to the playoff contenders, Wisconsin. And we will continue to rank all the schedules. Then we will preview and predict what these teams will do right here. Uh, Mark Rogers TV, the voice of college football. Please subscribe, like, and comment if you love college football.